Fishing's been pretty tough. Uh, a lot of blue sharks, small makos, but no one's really harvesting anything that's not going to make the weight. Uh, boats have to be in the harbor by 6 o'clock, and we'll keep you posted, and thanks for coming out. I'm here for my wedding anniversary, but uh, I got excited when I turned in and saw the uh, that there was the Never. shark tournament here, and uh, said, "Look, honey!" And she goes, "I guess we're going to this." Why is he putting his head in that fake shark? Because he's an idiot. What we do at the shark tournaments, we take advantage of a situation where there are going to be mortalities. We kind of have a partnership with the tournaments. We have a partnership with commercial and recreational fisheries, and it works to our advantage because samples kind of come to us rather than us having to go out and fish for these samples. At this point in time, the only way we can get these information is by studying dead animals. Let's see what he's got. Bait! And all that data, all those data, go to ultimately towards management. Well, first thing is what species it is, then what sex it is, then we wait until they uh, weigh it, and then they'll take a bunch of pictures and we'll cut it up. We have to know how old these animals get, how many pups they have, how often they pup during their lives, how old they are when they start to pup. 37.9. 37.9 length. 37.9 length. What exactly is that you're measuring there? This is the testy. It's kind of strange, yeah, it's very much an event. It's, it's kind of circus-like being in kind of the ring while they're all watching. Yeah, but they get into it. Oh. <laughs> What's that green stuff? It's bile. They cut through the bile duct. <laughs> So you were just squirted with green bile? Yeah. It's not happening. Everything to keep the crowd happy. I totally learned to tune it out. Once in a while, if somebody has kind of a voice that pierces through, but for the most part, I, it's white noise to me. It's the lore of sharks. People are fascinated by sharks. That's why they're always in the news. That's why, you know, the white sharks are a big deal. People want to see sharks. This, there were two hooks in this. We should be yeah, careful sticking your hands one. in there. It's right there. There were two in there. This, this, this is not this ours. This one was already in the... Okay. If you want to keep a note of that. I mean, they started gathering it like four. You know, to get their seats in case something come, came in, and now you can't even get out of this little area. So, as a scientist, what do you think about this? Uh, well, it's kind of odd to me. You know what I mean, but I would probably be in the audience if I wasn't a scientist. So, um, you know, admittedly, I'd probably want to see one too. Seven point five. It's kind of a shared fascination we all have with uh, with sharks. We want to keep a handle on sustainable fishing. We want to be able to manage these sharks so that the commercial and recreational guys can fish them, the people that like to eat them can eat them, and the people that like to dive with them and just see them can see them.